Hi guys, welcome back to Hit Pointed. My name is Robon. Today we are going to be continuing with Butch Fiddlebosu on day whatever that is. 260 or something. Yep. What were we doing though? What were we doing? We have morale, which is average. We have a fighting force. But I do want to check. Ah, I see, I see. So I did acquire some uh, Rodok recruits and I was leveling them up. Got it. Okay, yeah, yeah, I see what's going on. I see what's going on. Hey, Sarge Havoc, welcome back to the end, dude. Run down to this playthrough. Yes. We are a vassal of the Kurgits. And we've joined the weakest faction that is currently within the game. And we're trying to help them not be 100% defeated. We're also helping them uh, kick ass. Well, practically we're helping ourselves kick ass by uh, gaining some relations and gaining some fame. That would be the idea. Now I just gotta wait for uh, these guys to actually declare war on somebody. I don't know when they're gonna do that though. Oh yeah, it is control space. That's cool. Hey, so Mega, hey, Last Mutiny. Good morning to you two. How you boys doing? Are you gonna fight? You wanna fight? Fight me. Fight me, you step banditos. Damn it. Hey, you no bummer. Welcome back to the end, man. What's up? Oh. I actually have nowhere to run, right? Yep. They're mine. Surrender or die, bruz. Or perish. Infantry there. Cavs on the left side. It's okay. Hmm? Hmm? When did I hire you? Saw your name on the party list? I don't know. I don't know. Are you talking about one of the companions? Because I wouldn't know which one's your name. Oh! Jesus! Shoot them all! Shoot! Oh god! What the hell? That dude just... Did he, did he just... Dude! That is not cool. That is not cool. He... Okay, I'll have to grab one of these lesser horses. He crippled my horse. That son of a bee crippled my horse. Oh, so Rolf is your name. Cool. Ah, I missed. Missed by that much. Okay. That was my kill, man. You stole my kill. That's not cool. That's not cool. Okay, so out of this, I destroyed my shield and I lost my horse. That's not a good way to start the stream, god damn it. But we did win. And that should give us some extra morale. Really? I'm still fighting against eight? Sure. Everyone just charged this time around? Then I definitely need to heal up my horse. Stay behind my lines until the infantry engages? Why? This is not Bannerlord. I'm not really afraid of that much of the enemy in this one. Although my horse is afraid. Oh, so afraid. Oh, wait. Aha! Oh, oh my god, I'm, not, I'm actually never going to catch them in my life. Yep. I'm never going to catch that guy. Ever. Uh, archers? Aren't you supposed to just stay in one place and shoot? Just an unlucky charge? Oh, yeah. Yeah, just an unlucky charge. The, the only two guys that spawned with lances were lucky enough to be in front of me, and that's what kind of got me down. Literally. But it's fine. Got those step bandits, give me some of uh, those Horsinios there. And I am gonna switch out those uh, that lane horse. Yeah, definitely gonna switch my boy out. He's lame now. He needs to heal. He needs to become big and proper and burly. Like bull. Okay, the winner is, I guess, between these two. And they're both courses, so I don't really have a choice. There we go. Alright. Anybody else leveled up? Nah. There is no level. 
All right, let's go back to Nara. We're going to sell some of the horses, and then we're just going to spend some time there until uh, everybody heals up, including my pride. My pride is the most important that needs to be healed. I wonder if I am a prideful person. Hmm. Nah, I must have some pride. So the person that is drinking water out of a beer mug. Uh, hi, Kite. Welcome to the inn. How are you doing, good sir? Actually, how's everybody doing? How are you guys doing? How's your day going? I'm sure that for some of you, it's just started. Okay, we're at Nara. There's a tournament here. Was this my plan all along? The tournament? Pride comes before fall? Oh, but I fall so often, so mega. So often. Hey, Sinkotrope, welcome back to the end. I will die horribly many times. Wow, you're an optimist. Um, just wanted a mud bath and nothing happened to your horse. It's all an illusion. But the mud bath, I don't think that's how it works, man. 38, 38, 31, 29, let's scan, come down here, yippers, and just sell the rest of this trash, there, yeah, and I guess we're just going to join this tournament, which I will most likely lose, you have Thanksgiving in a couple of hours, that's cool man, that's cool, we don't really celebrate it here, we just ate pizza, was nice and it didn't include any turkey or stuffing no and that dude cheated clearly oh god oh jesus i needed to block that oh you son of a bitch okay i, I need a spear shield no no that is not what i wanted to do there it is there it is Jesus. You're getting back into the game? Alright, dude. That's awesome. Genuinely, it's true, though. Faith of the game avatars is gruesome. Oh, yeah. Faith of uh, video game characters in general. They tend to die. Yeah. Well, a good trade to start a campaign in native, but you remember it has zero variety in weapons and armor compared to PvP, so you dropped it. You could just play Floris. Unabomber. You could literally just play Floris. I mean, Floris is, uh, native enhanced. Or Banner Page. I've been hearing good things about Banner Page, for at least those who don't know about Floris. Oh, man. <sighs> Pardon. Come on, pizza. Don't try to get out right now. Could you please not? Ah, lame vision Somehow he blocked me from that angle. That is... That is not fair. Hey, did three damage. That's amazing. Try advancing your infantry down paces, then pull your your cavalry off of the flank and give the order to charge when the enemy hits your front line. If you found this tactic has the least casualties. I didn't really have a lot of casualties since beginning the playthrough. So, my God, I've been doing fine. Hmm? You don't select force, but as this weird feeling you can't really explain, it doesn't feel good to play. Okay, what about Banner Page? Oh my god, I think I would be better off just punching the dude. Oh, fuck me. Anybody has... Wait, is that a sword? No, nah, it's not a sword to get it. Hey, Smoothie, I am trying to kick ass. I am trying to break this guy, but he just refuses. Oh, Lord, please! Ah, God. Stop resisting! Cease! I'm not trying to give advice, just attack that allows your horse to live longer. Dude, calm down, some mega. I don't use. I don't usually lose horses. I was simply. I simply made a mistake. I wasn't. I wasn't being careful enough. That's all. 
All's good, man. Hey, now he's not gonna be able to block this next attack. <laughs> yeah! That's what you get. Hey, Strat's Multiplicated. Yep, indeed, we are warbanding it up. I will most likely lose in the finals. I have a tendency of doing that. It is my destiny. Oh my god, why? Oh my god, why? I just friendly fired one of my boys. And it wasn't pretty. Okay, I need a sword. Is that a sword? That is not a sword. Okay, catch. Oh, good lord. How? Why? Okay, as long as that dude... Oh, God. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. Oh, hello. Yes. Oh, yes, I do need that. Could you please stop? I am trying to attain victory. One second, good sirs. I am trying to kill somebody. Cryptic Bionic. Thank you for becoming a follower, my dude. Thank you. Well, the A wasn't necessarily a pussy. He was just trying to do whatever he could with his... Literally, I brain. Ha ha! Yes! Smacks the shabby. Goodbye, Hugu Noyan. Hello, holy crap! Quite accurate with that, huh? Mmm. Yes. Glorious. Right! Let's see, four teams, three fighters each. Banner page sounds good, we'll give it a try. I mean, it's kind of native with enhanced enhancements, I guess. I don't know. Oh, no. I don't know. Can somebody please die? I am trying to acquire a shield. If I'm sure, preferably. Anyone will do, including friendly troops. Oh, hello. We have a winner. Uh, no. That is literally what I have. Hey, I'm doing it. I'm not doing it. Okay, I think somebody dropped there. Yeah, 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 stay away from me. Ah, there it is. The shield that will save me life. Yeah! We're ready to kill now. Hello. Come on. Let me stab a fellow. There we go. No, that's mine. No, please. I am... Oh, what? I am trying to reach good, sir. Just get rid of the archer. Yep. Ah! Good! Holy shit, dude. You almost hit me. That's my job to friendly fire, not yours. Two teams, one fighter each. One sec. One sec on that'll read. Hmm? Am I gonna put it together and you want... Word of... Um... Warband guide after my playthrough? Why? Why would I do that? The original guide still works. And it still applies to everything. Why would I make a new one? What is missing, Submega? Ah, shiver me timbers. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> Mm. Mm. Remember when I said that I would die in the finals? That just happened. That just happened. Yeah. I got oofed. Hey, Alpharius. Welcome back to the indeed. Uh, game did an update for almost six years. Yeah, indeed. As I said, guide still stands. No need to do it, Sunmega. No need to do it. So I'm just going to wait here for a little bit of time. A day or two. Literally waiting for that declaration of the wars. The war to end and begin all wars. Come on, Kuzaid. Yeah, what? Uh, fuck. Yeah, tell that lady that I'm gonna go there. Yeah. I'm gonna go there so hard. Uh, attempt to visit the lady. Hey, baby girl. I could certainly do a war Warband Arena Guide. Nah. No. Why? Why would I make a... What is there to say about arenas? Which I guess gotta 
kill and be lucky that they're not gonna gang up on you. So that lady that I'm gonna cru that I'm gonna crush her. I think you want you what you wanted to say that I'm gonna smash her. Single is the final is giving yourself a limitation. Limitations have a tendency to come true. Okay, um, I will totally win a million dollars. It will suck so bad in a week from now. I'm not that patient. Tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, did you look for the quest to start a war? Greg, my boy. Greg, you have the big brain. I will do that. I will do exactly so. Okay, hi, lady. Okay, we have our... Um, Velika, Wurchig... And deflect the blah blahs. Nice. Okay, next time that I meet her. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Do you think you have a future together, milady? Uh, no, actually, tomorrow I think we're going to be... Question. Do you want Crusader Kings 3? Or do you want Total War Warhammer? Which one do you want? Tell me. Okay. Um. Your brother, Korcha, and I will never allow it. Perhaps it's the best that we part. Maybe I will change your brother's mind. Who's the, who's the brother? Do you think we have a future? Kaurchinoyan. Kaur okay, get it. I completely forgot his name. Kaurchinoyan. Let's see. Okay, so Smoothie wants Warhammer? I don't have Warhammer 3. It's not out, Smoothie. Alright, Pernagres and Alpharius wants Crusader Kings. Anybody else? Faction. Kurgits. Vassals are Karchinoyan. Okay, Kurcha is the Lord of Dugan. Hell yeah. Is he here? He is. Perfect. Okay, so two for Warhammer, two for Crusader Kings. That doesn't really help me much. Age of Empire 2? No. Don't actually own it. I'm not good at Age of Empire 2. No, not League. Haven't touched League in an over a year now. I don't think I'm going to be doing it. I would like to ask you something. I want to schnook your sister. I'm her lord and guardian. I have plans for her. You will not be mocked behind my back as a blah blah. But, mate... Wait, um, I would like to ask you, the, oh my god, is actually going further down, what the flying fuck, so I need to give you the positive with him, do you have a task for me, mate? Oh, this piece with the Saren is, is ill-suited. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly what we need, exactly. Y'all are clowns. Hey, Martin. Welcome back to the end, dude. So you got Crusader Kings 3 on sale? Have fun, man. Have fun. Torham Site, thank you for becoming a subscriber. You're a peach. Indeed, Greg. It's all coming together. You need to up those relations to above 10 with him at least. I will suck his... Yes. Yes, I will. So this, it, this piece all suits you. Let those swines have their way for far too long. Then they get stronger with each passing and their arrogance knows no bounds. Yeah, they, they didn't take anything from you. You must wage war on them before it's too late. Unfortunately, some of the bleeding hearts among our realms are blocking a possible declaration of war. You're a dick, aren't you? With less cowards. Okay, yeah, you're right, but what can we do? It's good to hear someone who understands. As a matter of fact, there's something we can do. A bit of provocation. If one of our war parties managed to enter their territory and pillage one of their caravans or raided one of their villages and perhaps left behind a little token or two of Kurjit Khanid, it would have ample cause to declare war on us. And then, well, even the cowards among us must rise to defend themselves. So what do you say? Fuck yeah, bro. I am totally in this, bro. And it's not to schnook your sister. Yeah. Raid on a caravan, or if you can't manage that, an attack on one of their villages should do the trick. Now good luck, and go kick ass. Nice. 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 Okay. 
Uh, what's the difference between this and the second game? Um, if you're talking about Crusader Kings 3, Crusader Kings 3 has a cleaner UI and better graphics. Have fun, Martin. Bye. There. Good to see you too, Torm. Torham. Yeah. Good to see you too. It'd be interesting to see if you favor increases with her father. I haven't seen that happen in your playthrough. That is not her father. That is the brother. Your reputation and you get one, two extra quests to do just for asking. Probably. Probably. Okay, let's leave and let's go find ourselves a caravan, which we will probably not be able to catch up to. We'll see. No, no, Martin, I was just wanted to close the subject on that one. But no, that is literally the difference between Crusader Kings 3 and Crusader Kings 2. Crusader Kings 3, I think, has a little bit less content, but the UI is much cleaner and it's much easier for you to learn it. So, yeah, I think that would be it. Do you have any sp specific questions about the game? And yes, definitely Crusader Kings 3 will have more options with DLC later. That is true. That is correct. Okay, let's find ourselves a, a caravan. Okay, my relation with somebody has been increased. How old is my love interest? I don't even know what's the name of my love interest. You. Lady Ajahan. Hey, so that's her name. Shit. But no, she's, she's 21. You're just reading through and going through tutorials on all the tips and hints and stuff, trying to understand how shit works. Martin, literally do the tutorial. Literally do the in-game tutorial, and you'll be just fine. You'll learn all of the specifics of the game. What? What? Literally, I literally said she's 21. What 10 and 9 have to do with it? I mean, I think she's she's even allowed to drink alcohol in America. Now that's what I call legal. No, I don't know the meme. What? Being wrong at math is now cool, and it's considered to be a meme? Is there a reason I'm going after her? No, not really. I just needed something to do during peacetime. It's an old meme with the kid. No clue. Remember you kidding getting into Crusader Kings 2 because everything was confusing as fuck until you found a 20 minute guide that explained the basics so well it didn't need anything else? Sure. My Warband Guide is probably the best, but it doesn't. It does need to be amended. Yeah, I could eliminate the swearing out of it. Swearing, if it went away, would be nice. Hey, hey a Caravanio! It is time to destroy them. Oh my god, is he running away from me? Good. Because I kill. I kill now. And that's cool. Usually hit up the gals with more families. Yeah, me too. But I just want a minister. I, I just want a prime minister. That is not one of my companions. That's all. I demand something. Wait. Oh, this is it. You're trespassing in the charity of the Christian Council. I'm confiscating this caravan and all its goods. Defend yourselves, snitch. And yeah, we listen on her. Hmm? Calls me friend and I want to kill him. Hell yeah, that's usually how it works, right? Everybody wants to kill their best friend. That's a little land though. Shh, Alfarius, it's not. It's not. Once uh, older brother has a little kid, what's 10th and the kid says 21, but on funny accent becomes a meme. Hilarious. But please, no, it's fine. I just lose one point of honor. Our chair only needs to be 15 to start an empire without total war. Yeah, but 30 is easier to get. Sorry, not easier. It's just easy to get 30, so it's bad. Spare them. Fuck no. Fuck yes. Then now there's nothing that I need to amend. To be honest, it just makes things easier if you have that amount of RTR. 30 is better than 50. How do you deal with villages you have raided before but are in your territory now? Do you just spam quests? You just spam quests, you know, bummer. Cease and desist, good sirs. 
Ah! Get killed. Oh wow, my horse you almost went bye bye. Hmm? You love this game? Hell yeah, you love this game. If you didn't love this game, why are you here? Watching this with me. Oh boy. Ah, got him. Oh god. That dude had a mace. Oh no! Oh, I'm dead. Unless I survive. Okay, I am gonna backtrack it towards my boys now. Yeah! Those are my reinforcements. Those are my boys. No! I wanted to attack that guy from behind. That horse is naked. Yup! It is. In the battle, be dead? Oh, yeah. In the battle, I'll be totally toasties. You're still waiting for your free drink, some nigga. It's a lie. Hmm? No, I don't have friendly manners enabled. Because people say that it makes the game easier. It's not a max difficulty. Yeah, that is the exact impression. That's exactly what people say. With that exact face. Exactly. Get your legs up high enough and you won't die in Battle Lord. Why athletics, Sarge? Why athletics specifically? Think it's ugly? The way I said it? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. It definitely is. Let's get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna go back to Nara. What is friendly ban banners enabled? Uh, when you can see the flag above your own soldiers' heads. If you're in your horse, you can run faster than the enemy. Okay. Athletics, you say. Why not just be on foot from the get-go, then? Yes, what Greg said. The friendly troop banners. I don't have them on. Yeah, little small icons above your friendly troops' heads, so you can tell which one are your friendly troops. But nah. But nah, I say you. Hey, uh, 9k in the bag. That's what's up. Trained crossbowmen, trained veteran crossbowmen, good. You are, but you guys said in Battle Lord you would be dead. That's the athletics remark. Hmm. Okay. Whatever. Never managed to bring my athletics above 100, I think. How fast can you get? Also, where's Dugan? Oh my god, Dugan is so far away. Wait, wasn't it Nara where I could attempt the, to visit the lady? Is it Tolga? No icons will save your troops from friendly fire. Fair enough. Fair enough. Hello, Brula. I would like to ask you the location of Chorka. He's traveling to Asagan Castle, and he should, be, he should be close to Dugan. Okay. Guess we're gonna go to Asagan Castle. You should. You can actually get pretty fast. In which one, Greg? In Warband or in Bannerlord? Belir. Ulmuda. Ulmuda. Sanyar Khan, those guys. Okay, I am close to here. Is he here? Oh, there he is. No, that's Asagan Noyan. Really, Asagan Noyan is the owner of Asagan Castle? Well, that's not, you know, narcissistic at all. In Battle Lord, your character got now has 216 athletics. 
and only the most elite foot soldiers can keep up. Well, I guess you just gotta go fast. Do you also have the heaviest of armor, Sarge Havoc? Not already you've gotten almost as fat as a horse. As fast as a horse, and you were around level 90. It's impossible. Impossible. What, what type of armor? Want to know the location of Charka? Should be close to Bardak Castle. Where the hell's Bardak Castle? Why is he so far to the south? Are we at war now? Did we just cause a war? No, I don't think so. You hate fighting the Kurchit Kana. Takes a month to chase them all down. You may join them on their next playthrough. Okay, so mega have fun with that. Switch to Sturgeon armor after the Empire armor got nerfed. Okay, so you have the heaviest of armors. So. Tease. Where is that dude? King and Ragnar of the Kingdom of the Norths was taken prisoner. What the fuck? I didn't even see any footprints or something to tell me his location. Hello? Charka, my baby boy! I found him. I found it. I don't know, the armor I know, you focus on speed perks, like minus 30% armor weight and the run boost. Cool. Hey! Oh my good god. Remuneration with Charka. Increased, increased, decreased. And I lose more honor. And lost the what? Whatever you did, the nobles of the Shannon Soldier are clamoring for war. Soon the time will come for us to reap the benefits. This war is going to make us rich. Reports. Faction relations reports. Yeah, well, the certain someone hates me. Notes of factions. The Kajits. The Kurjit Kana has recently suffered a provocation. By the Sarn Sultan, there's a risk of war. The Sarn Sultan was recently provoked. That subjects of the Kurgis, then there's a risk of war. So there's a risk of war from everyone. Damn. I lost a load? I think I gained a load. Ballard is unplayable for you? Why, Greg? Why is it unplayable? I mean, you literally told me that you're, fast, you're as fast as a horse with athletics. Is it because of that it breaks your immersion? It hate, you hate the fact that you're the Usain Bolt of uh, Bannerlord? Also, I feel like I gained... Okay. Honor rating 10. Definitely need some more. You gain with 2 or 3 with the nasty characters. The other ones all got a minus 3 to 5. Ah, perfect. I'm fine. I'm fine with it. I'm just going to make friends with them again. I just want to see the war happen. Nope. Oh. Okay, so Mega. Bye. Thanks for stopping by, dude. It keeps crashing since the update. Oh, that's it. Okay, just go back to the public server. Just go back to 1.5.4, man. Wait for 1.6. If it's that unplayable. You go to Tolga. Oh wait, I want to ask Sanyar Khan if he wants to go to war. Uh, what? Just go to 1.4. Greg, it's not that big of a deal. You don't have to play on the beta patch. The beta patch is known to be less stable. You're going to try to do some crusading and kinging? Just, just take your time. Have some fun, Martin. Um, I am so sorry, Sanyar Khan. It seems I have upset it to you. I apologize. Also, my God, I should have talked with that guy. Is he? Is this guy's gonna gonna talk talk shit to me? To no, no, he didn't talk shit. Yeah, sure. Expect expecting Crusader Kings to three to get dicked by most things, and eventually you're gonna get a hang of it, and you're gonna become better, stronger, faster, like bull. 
Best thing, it's almost weekend. For you, because I work on the weekend. Why am I smiling? It's not a reason to smile. Okay. Anyone know if they're going to speed up these updates maybe to a month? No. No, Greg, I don't. Don't think. Don't, don't get your hopes up, man. Just downgrade, go to 1.5.4, play the game if you want to. If you want to be patient and don't want to play it, play something else. Weekend work gang? Sure, yeah, weekend work gang. Okay, Uda Dundush. Oh my god, that name is so amazing. Dundush Noyan. The cousin of Dingus Noyan. I love that. It is the perfection of the world. Caravan. You're trying to get rid of your weekend shift? Good for you, man. Go for it. You put that leg in the door. You make it go away. Dingus Noyan. That was that's a perfect name to roleplay as. Mother F and Dingus Noyan, man. That's what's up. What the hell? I'm trying to I'm trying to tell if there's a spot on my monitor right here. Or if it's something else. That's just, that's the hospitality life. You're just gonna always work weekends. Sorry to hear that, my man. I'm sorry to hear that. Wait, who failed to respond? Please tell me that it was not us. Oh my god, yeah. We failed to respond to provocations because Sanyar Khan is a little shit. Okay, where is. Chorka. He's in the field close to Sharwa Castle. Sharwa Castle? I don't know what he's doing. I really don't know what he's doing. I think he's just taking advantage of the fact that he is on the border with the Serenids. I think he's just causing problems. Sounds like a Cassus belly to betray the Khan. Sure, man. Sure, because that's how I roll. But no, I just want a war. I just want a war. That's all. Some bloodshed. Some death and destruction. Why, hello, caravans. I don't think you want to... I don't want to fight you. I want to keep my honor in the positives. Uh, okay, there's ass again. Hey, ass again. How you doing? Come on, ass gun. Where are you? Let me talk with you. Oh no, one spotty man at arms, one of our one of are deserting because I can't. Want to load the location of Chorka. Closer to Gan. Damn it. I need a city. Okay, I have to reach a city. There he is. Okay, you son of a bitch. Relations eight. Um, task for me. What kingdom with the with the vagers, dude? Come on, stop it, stop it, just stop. It's it's one war is enough. But to be honest, with the kingdom of vagers, it might be a good idea to go to war just to take back Ikamur. Now that I'm thinking about it, but now I'm gonna go to Tolga and drink with the boys. Bring with the boys and grab some extra, extra stuff for them. Wandering bar germs and a hired blade. Hello? No, not every man. Wait, you can buy drinks for your soldiers anymore? Really? That's a thing? That's the soul, man. That's the soul. Well, clearly they're in dire need of some thirsty stuff. And there. Hey, Spectre, welcome back to the end, dude. Okay, apparently it's just in mods. I never knew. Yeah, I have to find some things to kill. 
I'm gonna go north towards the Zikamur and go towards the Seerator encampments and stuff. I need to kill something or my boys will just fucking hell run away like little bitches, which is not okay. Yeah, I always thought it was Vanilla as well. I have been mistaken in. Okay. Don't desert me, boys. I don't deserve this, even though I did just ignite the flames of war between two major factions. Which is sucky of me, but still. Okay, more trainer for the trainer god, more crossbow for the crossbow god. Tavern. Let's see. A traveler and a merc crossbowman. Lady. Nope. Okay, let's go. Am I being my own Jeremus? As an A doctor? No, I have a uh, companion who's my my surgeon, but I'm also going to be making my own character a surgeon late, late into the game. Because that's how I roll. Declaration of War between... No, Swati and Rodax, why? Come on, Swadia, don't you want to beat around some Kurgits or something? I'd be down. I have to go north. Fast. No, nah, no, no, they're too scared. They're too scared of the Kurgits. They can't handle this. <sighs> Pardon. Hey, Rollum. Welcome back to the end, dude. Ah. Get rid of a chug. Oh my god, 43 Sea Raiders, let me love you. Let me love you with the vengeance. Hmm? We've also decided to make the radial system optional with the future update, which means that anyone who prefers the tab classical mountain blade system will be able to enjoy it in the future too, confirmed. Oh no, shocking! How did they ever come to this conclusion? To cater for both PC and console? It is shock itself. Good call. I don't know, just good call. Sweet, sweet money from those workshops? Yeah, I know, man. Yeah, I know, this is the good shit. That was worth the grind. All right, Spectre, you go get some grub. Archers there, infantry there, calves on the side, infantry stand closer. We should be fine. Okay, okay, infantry one step forward. Archers one step forward. Yeah, yeah. That is not a lot of infantrymen that I'm looking at it. Oh wow, that sharpshooter just murdered. The name of the person that prevented the game to be a... Wait, the name of the person that prevent the game to be a G-O-T-Y arm again. She's the boss that always says no. Okay. Game of the year. Okay. Um, and why... Do you happen to know why that boss always says no? Yeah, exactly. Why though? Holy crap. Boop. I mean, I missed it. Yes. Also, how did you find this out? Uh, boss of Tales World. Smack dab in the middle. Go, Cavalry! They'll make it a run for it! Ah, man. Oh, also, I will forget that dude's name in a few seconds. Not sure, devs and community manager never talk about him. Just say between lines that he says no to most of the internal ideas. What about the external ideas? So, it's sad. It's sad that one person holds back a lot of things. Maybe it's because of the investment required to do those changes? What would be his idea? What does he want to do?
He wants to be edgy? Okay, does he want to add a lot of a, a lot of armor with spikes in the game? Sure, let him add armor with spikes. I don't know, maybe maybe do some give and take, you know? Maybe maybe okay, he wants to have ponies in the game, so we're going to add ponies. They're going to be optional. But in exchange for the ponies, we're also going to be getting knighthood orders. Yeah. Armageddon is the one who founded Tail World. Oh, so he's the CEO, or simply one of the founders. Okay, agility. Or oh, the agility god, also trainer one. That could work. Also, the weapon master could work as well. Goddamn. Uh, yeah, get some get some experience rolling. See their local Todd Howard. I don't think Todd Howard founded Bethesda. I'm just saying. Turn. Today, Caleb, community manager, as well as as well, throw a hidden message about a si sign that says we are in the same boat. When we criticize the world, oh, so they criticize as well. I see. Or maybe it's just a theory. Oh, how much money do I get? Holy hell, yeah, baby! It is time to grab the good stuff. Life of Alexini is the great. I think that's what gives me. Wait, I don't have enough space in the inventory to buy those books. But I think that's what gives me the leadership bonus there are you not I, I yes he has been unlamed glorious yeah back in business do you have sexy food here yes you do good that's enough and go back to here and check with the books sounds like politics that's why they don't want game of the year Okay, they're clearly disagreeing about something. I recommend that they just talk it out. And if that doesn't work, just pull out the pitchforks and the torches. So what does he want? What is he trying to accomplish? When will the game be finished? Don't know. Well, even Mexico said on a post about 10 to 20 awesome ideas. Some like, I'm 100% sure that this game would be a 99% votes on Steam and 50% more players just adding half of these changes, but Armageddon prevents most of them to happen. So clearly is not a problem with the devs. Okay, then it's a problem with the pencil pushers up above. What do the pencil pushers want? Do they just want to bring out the game in its current state and just fix everything? Because, to be honest, what do pencil pushers want? They want to make money. They want to return on their investment. They want to make cold, hard cash. It was what I'm expecting from a pencil pusher, from, a, from one of the bigger, bigger wigs up top. That's what I'm expecting from them. If they want more money and higher revenue and higher interest, they will, they, most likely they're pushing towards finishing the game. They're pushing towards not adding content, but fixing and bringing the game to a status that is acceptable to today, today's standards. That would be the idea. Um, probably once the game comes out fully, completely, then he's going to think about adding extra stuff you know you know you could actually put him down and talk him down hey listen we're gonna fix the game we're gonna make it uh, ready for 1.0 because that's kind of the vibe that i'm getting from all of the patches that have been coming out lately just fixes and stabilization and once it's ready for 1.0 when it's ready to be fully released we're going to be adding these extra changes into kind of a dlc or into kind of a future patch major changes something which is going to get which is going to give the community a second wind or something like that it could work honestly to make more money they could just go the crusader kings 2 route and release dlcs for money for more features exactly alfarious sadly it could work what if armageddon is trying to make a fortnite pay to win and that's won the rpg we don't know man we don't know what that dude wants we sadly we are not in a position to give him um, 
an opportunity to explain himself either. Who knows? DLC would be weird since Wormbatter was the most important game and template DLC. The only good DLC was Viking Conquest and it wasn't made by them. It was a modder as well. Yeah, but the modders hired those. Uh, the modders were hired by Tales World afterwards. And it was indeed a template of a mod. Brittenwald, for those who were wondering. Okay, Dere Militari, no. Rhetorica at Herenium, Book of Healing. Yeah. Life of Alexinius. Oh god, I want both of those. Nice, I can actually grab all three. Amazing. Also, SAN logic gives me more intellect. That's, that's also cool. But now I need the surgeon, I need the trainer. Yeah, brother. Yeah, look at that shiny stuff. We got the good stuff now, boys. Also, I'm going to decide to read that book. By the looks of it, yeah, I'm not going to be gaining any more into that department. So leave, camp, take an action. Select the book to read The Life of Alexinius, the big boy. Good, and now we're going to walk a little bit to the west to get ourselves some extra enemies. Also, he's the same guy in charge of Warband. Or was? Is? I don't know. The shows are basically a lifeblood of game companies now. Simply. By the time the game is fully released and mod tools are 100% over and they have no chance to beat modders. Yeah, I agree with that statement, sadly. They're literally... Okay, they might delay the modding tools. They have the power to stop the modding tools and create modders... Modders life a um, And make a modder's life a living hell. That is something. Uh, but I don't think they're going to go down that route. Indeed, we didn't have modding tools on Warband. Will I ever catch those guys? Also, the shovel leveled up. What am I looking at? Oh, my Pathfinder. Pathfinding, spotting, trainer, tracking. Everything is correctly placed. Uh, give her one extra point to do Weapon Master, and we're going to keep that point for when she levels up. Just so we add extra points to whatever we need. We'll see, man. We'll see what's gonna happen. Oh god, I'm, I'm as fast as those guys. I will never catch up to them. You would remove the modding tools if they plan to make a good in def RPG? Nah, man. They're hurting themselves if they remove the modding tools. The only reason Warband survived this long was because of the modding community. Yeah, they will definitely have modding tools on DLCs still. I think so. Hmm. At least we will get audio on Battlelord. It's confirmed. I'm sorry, we will get what, Relum? Audio on Battlelord as in more music? Voice audios. Oh, voice commands? That'd be interesting. Nah, yeah, to it, that'd be cool. Conversation voice recorded by real persons. Waste. Voice dialogue. Oh, so... Ah, so no voice commands. Voice dialogue, that's a big difference. Okay, yeah, sure, that's cool. Do you want modern tools on release? Because after the game has been out for a while, sure, but I don't know about on release. Uh, Greg, modding tools are already out. What are we talking about here? Sure, sure, yeah, when talking with NPCs. That's not really something that I look forward to. Sure, I feel like that's a complete secondary, but okay. Really hope they utilize the having kids ability as the game is now. You'll win before your main guy dies. Yep, pretty much. I feel like they just need to forward time. It enhances RPG and immersion. Okay, sure. Alpharius, it's fine. 
apparently they're going to be resolving this in uh, the next patch on 1.6, where they're stating... Wait, what's she saying for me that there's going to be another Fisa Tolga? Man. Where they're stating that they're going to make kingdoms last at least 10 years without kicking the bucket. My kids should be alternatives to companions someday. You return with the fog. Fuck yeah. Also, I forgot to check the chat to see if there's a run some broker over there, goddammit. <clears throat> okay. Some soldiers leveled up. A veteran, but not a Deshavi. There. Next patch as well, all clans will start with at least one castle and one town so they don't become poor on day one. Okay, that's cool. I don't think they need to add extra castles, but we'll see, Greg. We will see. Now I'm actually curious to see what they're going to be doing. Hello Zorg Zorg, welcome back to the end dude. You heard Tell Tale Worlds is releasing a new Napoleonic War. Really? Where did you hear that from? Map revamp is necessary and already one person did it from scratch, but Tales World don't have plans on changing it. Oh say, so somebody revamped the map, but they're not gonna but Tales World will not change it. I'm I'm seeing a problem there somewhere. Hmm? Was Napoleon that popular? Napoleon was good. And to be honest, they'd be dumb to not re-release their DLCs in the new Bannerlord. If they can, hell yeah, why not do it? It's cheap and cheesy, but if they can, why not? There's a big problem on the map and is one of the main causes of, of snowballing and unbalances. It's not well designed. <laughs> to be honest, the AI needs a revamp, not the map. But sure, sure, maybe the map needs one as well. I mean, they make a new Viking Conquest, that'd be amazing. It would be. It would be cool. Wait, visit the... Uh, need to visit the lady again, sure. Wilbur Band. Wilbur Band needs saving. That's where I have two entries and exits. That is perfectly viable. Viking Conquest felt so fresh when they released it. So many new features. Mm. Wouldn't be super easy to just add big armies patrolling and the factions lands to defend. Or give huge auto-resolve buffs to defenders. That'd be too much, man. That'd be too much. If they would give huge auto-resolve buffs to defenders, you would get into a situation where you're like, uh, Why am I always losing when I'm attacking in a siege? That's not fair. That's, I think, what, what would happen. Yeah, infantry charge as well. That's okay. Okay. Smack. Farmer killed my bandit. Shocking. Oh no, it's a farmer. He'd be a good guy. Ah man. You gotta move. There it is. There it is. Turn around and keep swinging that sword. Good. Beautiful. Nice. I feel like there should be something forcing the attack. God damn it. I feel like there should be something forcing the attackers to take edge reasons first before being able to siege something deeper into a kingdom's border in Battle Road. If that makes any sense, don't know if you phrased it poorly. No, I understand. I don't find it interesting that the army is gonna march all the way to the other side of the enemy's kingdom to take a castle they, they will clearly will not be able to defend. 
Hmm? Uh, little cheats like that because they have 20% bonus on auto kill is one of the issues of Snowball. Yeah, also Vlan Vlandia has that 20% bonus cheat on auto kill because they're the only two factions that have mostly cavalry based armies. Castle with 100 guys should be easily be able to hold against 1,000 men army. It is ridiculous that cities fall so easily. Mm -hmm. Refuse that. You don't even think they fixed the problem they say they fix? Mm. If they make the AI mostly take cities by starving them out, it would fix snowballing? It might. Oh, not enough money. Damn. We gotta wait. Gotta go to it, come on. Hopefully, I'll find ransom brokers there. Sieges actually are a total mess on the paper. It's 20 times better than Warband, but when AI is not working as expected, it's a poor experience. It is. Give the sieges factions time to recuperate while the castle was being sieged. Indeed. Sieges are unplayable, they crash. It's ridiculous that the AI can take cities with like 500 peasants in their army. I think recruits should be almost worthless in simulated siege battles. I guess so. To be honest, they need to play some Crusader Kings 3. The developers of Bannerlord need to take a step back from their game. I, I Yeah, I know that's that means we're going to have list patches. But yeah, the developers take a step back from the game and go play some Crusader Kings 3. Just go enjoy some video games. Check, yeah, just go and play some other video game, strategy game, something similar that they would like to integrate into Battlelord. See how it works, see how it feels, and then brainstorm how to integrate it into Battlelord. It's perfectly fine that they would do so. And if they're gonna bring out a patch in three months from now, not, not, not one month, not two months, in three months from now, with the ideas that they have been integrated from other video games, I would be down. I would be so fucking down for it. I would 100% support that decision. You like to see less recruits and more tier 2 troops? I would like to see that too. A lot of compar compar uh, comparisons already on forum, taking Crusader Kings 3 as example. Yeah. Really like a combination between Crusader Kings 3 and Mountain Blade. Guys, imagine half, not full, half of the diplomacy tree from Crusader Kings 3 integrated into Battlelord. Half of it, not the full thing, because that would be too much. Half of the pl diplomacy tree. It would make things super sex. They don't have to take everything, they just need to take what's good and what would make sense. And they would have the bestest of times. Good. Yeah, they already have the family mechanics. <sighs> but for right now, currently in the game, currently in the game, castles are useless, completely pointless, pieces of land. Clans are useless. I never talk to any of my clan members. The only things that I do with my clan members is I tell a dude to become a caravan or I tell a dude to become a party member. Or, or just gather a party. That's it. Um, so, castles are worthless. Clans are completely worthless. Kids are worthless. Because you either don't play with permadeath on, or you don't die. Your character just doesn't die, and you end up using those kids as maybe companions. The entire stewardship tree is worthless. Besides the fact that it increases your companion, your party size, which is not really by much, um, there's no governance system in place. Oh, speaking of, governance is broken. Completely useless. Um, you just build projects that you will most likely not be able to hold a fief, or it's not going to pay off because the tax system is broken. There's so much shit that they need to go and just remake from the ground up so yeah you saw one by one first those quality of game changes are too good right you're talking about prisoners 
So yeah, man, they, they need to do a lot of stuff. Some of those are really easy fix. To be honest, even the economy, the fact that you pay your soldiers once a day is stupid. Fucking stupid. Initially, when I saw, oh my god, we, we receive money once a day? <sighs> I'm gonna be rich faster. But I was dumb. I was just dumb. That is counterintuitive. I would much rather prefer to have to worry that I need to pay my men at the end of the week and try to scrounge up ways to make that cut. Yeah, man. To be honest, they have to really rewatch a little bit of Warband as well. Maybe they should go back and play some Warband Classic. See how they had their systems before. Because I feel like a combination of the economy from Warband and from Bannerlord, a combination between the two is the way to go. Usually easy fixes don't happen just because some lazy manager or whatever in a company can't bother to confirm the ticket. It's it's fine, it's in a row. It's, it's okay, there's, there's no point. Tons of mods already that fix major issues of the game, just need to copy-paste. It's not, it's again easier said than done. Maybe those mods are actually fucking up with other systems that we don't really notice. Man, it's complicated. It's just, we can talk all we want, but we don't really know what's going on behind closed walls. We have no idea what the fuck is going on over there, boys. Sure, more poetry for the poetry gods, that's fine. It's fun to complain and talk about ideas for the game, though. Doesn't really help that much. Doesn't really help that much. I mean, I, I think the only person who actually has a benefit from discussing these ideas would be Relum, who's actually active on the forums. And he might take some of our ideas and go to the forum and put them out there. That's kind of it. A dev published a new roadmap on October. Okay, and what is this roadmap, Relum? Come to Ankara, you can storm the tail sword heads orders they get, or that is the stupidest idea I've ever seen, Mustrovich. Me, you, and everybody else have no right to storm anything. It is an intellectual property of Tales World. We should have no say in the matter. If they want to delete Bannerlord tomorrow, they can do that. And they can let the current copies that are present and bought by players to keep them, and that's it. They could do that. And we would have nothing to say on the matter, Mustrovich. They should just do some research into feudalism economy and how sieges actually went down. Sure, man. Sure. Or they could just go the other way around, not give a fuck about feudalism or history or stuff like that, and just own the fact that Coloradia is a fictional world set in, set in a fantastic history where they can just make whatever shit they want. And that's it. Media posts with multiple points on campaign, character system, quests, main story, combat, UI, and art. That's nice. Hopefully they're going to stick to it. You reinstalled 1.5.5 for the fourth time and now it works? Good for you, Greg. That's awesome. You'll wonder if players would want to wait three years for a siege to be over. Who knows? Maybe make the... You know what? They could even make the in-game time to move faster. If they want to. They could totally do that. Hell, if it would be three months, I'd be down with it. If a siege would take three months in game, it'd be cool. Because, I don't know if you guys noticed, but time moves pretty fast in this game. It's it's kind of shrunken. It's it's moving.
A day doesn't really take that long. Another reason why 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 I find the paying paying and receiving money a day just so ridiculous. Wait, 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 whoa, 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 there, brother. No, god damn it. Yes, just kill me. I'm, I'm done with this place. There it is. Good, finally got what I needed. Check this guy out. Somehow, someday. Nope, careful. Finally got to. Good, I can go in the next round. <sighs> hmm? uh, the most relevant points are maybe rebellions, granting ring quelling fiefs, improvement kingdom decisions, a child education feature that will allow players to shave their clan's offsprings before they come of age, an option to disable birth, death, and aging, which is already in the game. Okay, no, no, you actually can't disable birth in the game. Ability for players to break out of prison from dungeons, okay? 30 days even would allow your faction to recover from a lost pitched battle. Yeah, they could. So maybe field fortifications and traps to act as combat multipliers would be cool as well. Okay. Pitch. Just put pitch on the battlefield and burn everything up. And also not that noticeable when a day goes by? Nah, not really. Oda Nobunaga would like to have a word with that. Okay. You just go. You you boys just go away and have a talk with Oda Nobunaga, okay? Just, just go have a good word with him. Have a good chat. Uh, the paper panel was going to have a system to upgrade your castles and towns by three levels and watching it visually improve such as wood walls, rock walls, but we didn't have it. We do have a form of it, only it's just not really very well implemented. And even if you did upgrade that, you don't really see how it helps. Because... In the current game, the moment you have four trebuchets, you've cracked any castle. Give or take with two or three days. You only assaulted fortification if you had extremely overwhelming numbers. If you were worried, they would be relieved soon. Yeah, you can, but they're useless. Completely useless. Two things, three fighters each. Shit. God damn you. Ah, oh, man. This is gonna take forever. He is fast. I think he's faster at, sl at slashing than me. There we go. Most trebuchets couldn't even do that in real life. Except maybe Werewolf. Mm. You can visually see the walls change when you upgrade them. They go from sand, mud, to wood, to stone. Yes, I know, Greg, but they're useless. The upgrades are pointless. One of the ideas you proposed yesterday was to make the world progress with you. So late game is not just a bunch of battle simulators destroying all over the world. Once you have high tier troops. Um, could you please elaborate that idea, Relum? Got his kidney out with one swing. Shit. Nah. Shit. Okay, let's just stop bitching about it. There's no point. There's no point. If you want to bitch about it, go on the forums. Yeah! Go talk civilized in a civilized manner on the forums. I'm looking at you, Mustrovich. 
No invading the headquarters in An Ankara talks, okay? It's not going to solve anything. That's actually going to make things worse. Shit, really, three jeans. Crap, crap, crap. Okay. Go give them a hand. Because, well... Blabbering your mouth doesn't really help a lot, now that I think about it. Unless you actually tell it to the right people. And of course, you need to make sure that it is... The, me the message is transmitted in a nice, polite, and constructive way. The hell? Oh, that was not one of mine, okay. Mercenaries, bandits, all patrols in general of the game and even other reigns being stronger so the game progresses with you, your level as well. Being the game a challenge and forcing you to play more tactical and not just F1 F3 for 50 hours. You okay? Kind of curious. Oh wow, I just killed the brother of my future wife. That's amazing. Uh, okay, sorry, Lum. Um, I'm not so sure if it's a good idea, but yes, I do agree that they need to make the late game with more activities. They need some money sinks, at least. If they keep the, the current system, they need some money sinks for the late game. You've seen many posts and forum discussions about the flaws of the game, and they were even messaged back by Tales World, but nothing really happened. Okay. How about time, Master Vegas? They just need time, dude. They need time to be able to implement shit. Everything needs time. And who knows? Maybe Arman or whatever his name is said, nah. Nah, I don't like Master Vegas' face. I'm not gonna implement those fixes. I'm just giving a absurd example. So you can't yell at someone to tell them to fuck themselves? You can. But don't expect it to bring anything in your favor, Spectre. Best way to use money on late game is actually to include custom orders and castle customizations. So you need to invest tons of money or to make it stronger. Currently, the only reason you would make a ton of money would be to negotiate the joining of a lord towards your side. Invasion factions, kind of like Vendor, would be cool to keep things fresh. Maybe target the stronger factions. Would be interesting. He is getting on my nerves. Ha <laughs> ha! I want out of this tournament. I want a war. Nope. Ha <laughs> ha! Good, and then he's gonna throw stuff at me. Yep! Holy shit, he's throwing stuff! God! Okay. I gotta go on the offensive. And that's not a good sign. Hmm? Apparently, Chelsea doesn't like the face of all of the people in the forum then. Apparently. Apparently, man. All we can do is wait and hope for the best. Worst case scenario, the modding community will fulfill all of your wishes. Okay. We just have to be patient. So we just gotta be a little patient. Maybe shoot him from foot? Nah, I'm too scared. Holy shit, those things are super close. Oh lord. Mm, and there's the hit on the horsey. Got him! Woo! Yeah! Yeah, yeah. Nailed it. Please don't give me another bow and arrow. You know what? I'll take it. How in the name of everything that is holy? Yeah! Stab him in the chesticles. Tickle him in the chest. 
was amazing. Amazing. I didn't even look at the battle. It was that intense. Okay, join the feast. Hugu, Akadan, Senor Khan, hey Sani. Yeah, you love that shit, don't you? Good. Dundush, Belir, Urmuda, Asagan, Charka. Hello, Choki. He's cooperative. Hmm, interesting. Keep that in mind. The chesticles, yes. My wife just gave me this silent, short, but impactful disapproval face. She was something like, and something in me died. It hurt my soul. Hurt my soul. Okay. Yes, maybe. Maybe the soul from my butt died, okay? Disapproving look, man. The wife's disapproving look. It hurts, man. It hurts. You'll know. You'll know soon. You'll know. Why you do this, Ruval? Is because I said chesticles. I think. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. It's because I said chesticles. Alrighty. Uh, let's wait here some a bit. I don't want to go do that quest again. But I'd like to talk a little bit with that schnitzel puff just get used to it mm. Mm. hi task for me no what the fuck man okay I'd like to ask you the honor of god damn you okay he hates me a little bit more now because I asked for his sister's handiness Someday he's gonna like me. Hello, Tylerism. Welcome back to the end, dude. One Ice Tea coming up. Ice Tea is heresy. You're heretical, Spectre. If the man wants to enjoy some iced tea, he will enjoy some iced tea. And you should not give a fuck about that. Can I just go beat people? Now that I am in the negative with the Serenids, can I just go beat them up without any repercussions whatsoever? Hell yeah, ST is night. Fist bump. Yeah. Why on earth are you pink now? I don't know. You're still green for me. Your username is still green on my side. Okay, let's start beating up people, I guess. Peace agreement between the Nords and the Vagers. Good. Hey, hey! Hey, Mir Bilia! My Billy boy! Let us fight. Duke it out. I am the Butch of the Fiddle. I say this only once. Okay, with Cernid Sultan has deteriorated, and just with this guy has deteriorated. Perfect. Okay, boys, let's get ourselves some places. Probably gonna position my archer extraordinaires here. And cavalry on the side. Let the shooty shooty begin. Actually, that's quite a few calves here. Oh, God. Cavalry, go! Uh, that was, actually, they, they didn't charge. That was my mistake. Oh god, they're charging. My boys are charging. I can't stop them now. It's over. I will stop you! Wait, what the fuck are they doing? Guys? Also, that is a lot of... Oh no, that's mine. That's a lot of calves he's got there. 
Oh boy, infantry, infantry charge please, yeah. Yep, that's a lot of serenids. Sorry, that's a lot of Mamluks. Emir Bully. Painful, man. Painful. Hello? The, you boys don't seem to be mine. Definitely not mine. Are those master archers? Holy shit, they are. Time to get some killing going. Got him. Beautiful. Sword Sisters down. Off with your heads. Wait, where did you guys come from? Holy shit. Oh man, this was a massacre. Good. Thanks, boy. Got him. Nice. Oh, where did those guys come from? Retreat time. Retreat and re-engage time. I am totally retreating, yes. Good. Casualties done. The enemy lost some dudes. So I lost 18 men from that. Damn. Legendary Morningstar. Legendary Morningstar. It's sexy. Yeah, they're still staying into formation for some other reason, but no, that was a good, good stuff. Although I do, did lose a lot of people. Mostly archers. Hmm. Need more infantry, I guess. 56 against their 66. What am I looking at? Or we could just employ a lot of SWATI knights. They just do the job for us. Are they charging in? By the looks of it, yes. They're coming from that direction. Nice. There. There. Go, 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 go. Cavs to the left. Yeah, I see them. Right here, boys. Not too far away. Hell, form a line in front of my boys. That should be fun. Now let the shooty shooty begin. We will let them make the first move. We should play to our strengths, which is our range. For right now. Okay, that was completely pointless and useless. Gotcha! Oh my... No, no, no. Fuck, I thought I killed them. That'd be glorious. If it was me. But no, seriously, what the fuck are they doing? Are they charging? Are they not charging? I feel like they're just wasting time. Just a little bit forward. Okay, Cavs, go in. Go in, Cavs. Go in. They've been softened enough. Mmm. Yeah. Those boys got smacked. Smack a delicious definition makes the boys go loco. Because that is where it's at. Good. Anybody else? Yeah, this round went a lot more in our favor. Oh my god, I think I... I'm so sorry, Slave Crusher, no! My baby boy. Oh my god, my horses. Oh, my horses, I think, has been lamed again. Also, are those hired blades? I think that's a hired blade. Yep, that's a hired blade. These boys don't really care about having only serenade armies and stuff. That's kind of cool. I kind of respect that. I respect that a lot. Good job, boys. Wait, which one was the enemy in that scenario? The boys be riding. Yeah. Oh yeah, something happened with my horse. It is slow as fuck. Most likely you need some love. But yeah, that worked. That worked. Still lost a dude. Still fighting against two soldiers, apparently. Everyone charge. Everyone get them. And get them good. But yeah, this should be easy. This should be like shooting fish in a barrel. 
Which I never really understood why is shooting fish in a barrel any easy. Oh, no, no, actually, no, I don't understand because they have nowhere to run. They're literally in the barrel. Yeah, I guess. I'm gonna get them eventually. I swear I will reach my enemy like it's nobody's business. Did, did my boy just fall off their horse? No. No, it is the enemy who fell off the horse. Good. Good, good. No, he managed to escape, which kind of made this entire battle pointless, but I have 12 Mamelukes. I have 12 Mamelukes, and I have 14 Master Archers, which is going to bring me a lot of goddamn cash. Hell yeah. Also 14 Desert Bandits. Going to make something with these Desert Bandits? No, not really. 31? 5? 39? 4? Oh, there's some good shit here, boys. Good stuff. Can I do a Viking Congress playthrough after this? I don't know. I'll think about it. I'm not making any promises. Okay. I guess I also leveled up somewhere at some point. Agility up. Surgery's fine. I need some extra inventory. Could use those tactics. Could I, I could use that persuasion as well. Yeah, get the persuasion up a bit. Up a bit. There. Next, Matheld. More strength for you. No, could give you some pathfinding, but I'm going to give you some trainer for right now. Get some experience for the boys. Sounds good. Make you useful while you're in my army. Rolf, agility. I think some trainer for you too. There. Nord veterans to Huskarls, Sharpshooters, Crossbowmen, Swadian Knights, Slave Crusher. Ooh, Elizabeth died. Okay. Dushavi. Wait, no, 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 no. I want you at my side. And no, you haven't leveled up yet. Good. Let's walk away. And let's go lick our wounds and ho hopefully sell a big pile of prisoners back in Tolga. Yeah, we'll definitely need some. Uh, some more boys. More boys to reinforce. That was a one battle and it kind of hurt us. Hell yeah. Cash. Good. Tavern. Please sell me. No! No! They moved the ransom brokers. God. Why? Okay, Alan. Let's go through your through your gear. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. 39 for... Yep. Yeah, that's better. 5. 5. No. Heavy kite shield. Leather covered round shield. 310 resistance 8. Yeah, man. That's some good stuff. Resistance 20 with 224. Not a bad piece. 35, 36, 38. There we go. There. God, the faces in this game look bad. Mathel, you're next. No. 37, 4. Yep. 5 on that. Chipped iron, chipped arming, batter the lead. Better the lead is definitely better than nothing. Kettle 35, no. No, she's fine. Next up, Ferentis. Ferentis the fire. 36-3, nope. You could use some mittens though. Ah, uh, that's an that's an okay shield. No need. Kettle hat, nah. Now he good. Gucci. That's Rentis, that's Rolf. 40, 38, 5, no more. And that's Behester. 32, 10, 36, 3. I'll give him that. It's okay. No. Nope. I want no. Okay, the rest will be sold. Unless somebody here wants it. Nah, I don't think so. It's fine. Marketplace, goods, sure. Lay more horse would be nice. Mm, 
Okay, which one's the cheapest? 35. 34, that seems good. There, there, there. Good, and buy myself some of this food. Okay. Arms, no. I'm gonna do a head count. What do we got here? Nord veteran, marksman, sharpshooters. We're okay on that regard. We have a lot of shooty squads. We're okay. I think we just need we just need infantry to be honest. We just need infantry, and we're gonna be getting some infantry from the northern front. So let's go there. How many northern fronts do I have? Veteran 3, Huskarl 12. That's not bad. Hmm. Hmm. 10 of each. Yeah, 10 of each. 10 infantry, 10 archers, 10 calves. Should be fine. Sounds about right. Sounds about right? Mm, it sounds about right ish. Yeah, let's go with it. Uh, next stop, we're going to go to Ravadin and visit some of their villages. Also, to find myself a ransom broker. My eternal walk to find myself ransom brokers. Tis what I need. Tis what I require. Tis what I desire. I don't know. I just want to pay my... Get, get paid for that battle in the desert. Because that was a good battle. Too bad I didn't really get to make friends with that boy. Want to be buddies, best buds. Okay, so what do I get from here? Five major recruits. I'll take it. Wilbur ban. Border incidents between Kurgits and Swadians. Really? Sure, we can take Halmer back. I'm down for that. I'm down for that. Recruit. Nobody cares. Gonna go to Ike. Recruit. Three. Sure, I'll take it. Tavern. Ransom broker, finally. Oof. That was a good pile of cash. That was a good pile of cash. I like that. I like that a lot. Okay. Leave. And go to Sabuya. How many recruits? Five. Sure. I'll take it. And I'll get rid of... Good. Next stop. Vyage. Vyage. And maybe Fanata someday. Maybe Fanata someday. Yeah. Soldiers. Sharpie the shoots. Yeah. Oh my god, all of those dudes leveled up. That is amazing. Yeah. And they're going to become skirmishers, and then we're going to make them into archers. Hello, Andre. Welcome back to the Old But Gold. Are you referring to this game by chance? Because, yeah, it's a good game. Four recruits. Good. Gonna go to Kewin, try to grab some boys from there. Deserters, that's interesting. Yeah, I thought you might be referring to that one. Eight recruits. Good, and how many room do I still have? Nine. Okay, yeah, nine Swadians will be joining the mix. Next stop, Ribolet. Or Talber. Tal Tal Talberl. That's another 10 level ups, 8 level ups for these guys. Amazing. 8 footmen. 9 skirmishers. Hell yeah. Wait, what footmen? Major footmen? I have a major. No, 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 that's fine. Never mind. Never mind. I'm just being a dumb, a dumb, dumb. Two Swadians. Sure. I can make it work. Iberin. Five. 
How many left? Two more. Two more further, two more good. Yeah. We got it, boys. We got our forces back. Now we just need to level them up a bit. 34 forest bandits. Good place to train. On the souls. Everyone charge. What? 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 I forgot my horse. You! Get off! I need you- Oh my god. I forgot my horse. How the hell do you forget a horse? Why didn't I notice that I didn't have a horse on my sprite? I can drink some sprite right now. Hey, Rolf is killing it. Nice. Hey, Bash is dead. Nice. Well, he's not dead dead, like you would see in Battlelord. Also, those slaver chiefs are putting in work. Damn, son. Damn, son. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <sighs> yeah. Karen, catch me. I carry this battle totally not. Good. Oh my god, yeah, I was on foot all along. But my horse is still lame. So I will have to take the stubborn step horse. Which one has better speed? Yep, of course it is. Horse me up, spotty. Okay, so at Ux Call, we're gonna go into the holy crap, that was a lot of bullets. We're gonna go here, we're gonna sell some stuff. Gonna buy some extra food. I'll buy you boy some pork, and I'll buy you some honey. Yeah, that sounds about good. Level up for some soldiers. Nord trained footmen. Nine Swadia militia. Oh yeah, they're leveling up nicely. Me likes. Me likes what me sees. Oh wait, wait, wait! Yeah, tell the lady that I'm gonna be there someday. Uh, take a walk through the tavern, see that there's a ransom broker, give him a big kiss. Right on his mustache. Mm -mm. And walk away. Hey, Warboy, welcome back to the end, dude. Um, gathering up the forces, leveling them up, gonna go back on an offensive against the Serenids. Get my revenge. Even though I did defeat them in the previous battle. Vengeance! But first, a booty call. No, I don't really care about the man hers. Not playing Shadowlands? No, I'm not playing Shadowlands. Probably gonna be waiting for Shadowlands to be on discount during Christmas or something. I don't know. I'll see. I should really ask my brother if Shadowlands is worth it. If it's good. Yeah. Definitely footmen. Good, and those boys will become man at arms and everything's gonna be peachy. Are you playing Shadowlands? How is it? Also, for those who don't know, Shadowlands is the latest DLC for. Yeah, latest expansion for uh, World of Warcraft. Cabbages. And some cheese. Yeah. Is a Vager Skirmisher better than a North Veteran Archer? I don't know, Nick Jaw. But I know that a Vager Marksman is definitely better than a Veteran Archer. Nord Veteran Archer. Oh, yes. That is what I know. Okay. Let's go see what the Serenades are up to. Yeah, you better stay away from me, Caravan. It's pretty fun. You love the gothic vampire zone, and the leveling has been pretty good so far. Okay. What's the level of cap? 60? There's your archers, trained footmen, swatting footmen. Yeah. 
But yeah, if you aren't a massive WoW fan, then I'd wait for the Christmas discount too. No, I'm not. I can't say that I'm not a big WoW fan. I've consistently been playing all of the expansions, but I don't feel like it's worth giving that much money. I'll just wait for a discount or something. Where the boys at? Let's go for Cherise. Looking for a fight. And a fight I shall have, maybe? Question mark? Yep, 60. You've been playing for about 10-ish hours and you're only 54. I'm sorry. So, I assume you start sh the Shadowlands content at 50, correct? You've been only playing for 10 hours and you're already a level 54. Isn't that a little bit fast? I don't know, I would say 10 hours, 2 levels maybe? Make it a little bit more on the grindy side? Just a bit? Make make you feel like you've worked for those levels? Is it is it just me? Is is it just me? Or does it feel like it's pretty fast and furious? Okay, wow, well, where are all of these boys at? I am seeking out enemies and I am not... Entertained. It's fast considering most of the game is at end game with current WoW. Okay, fine. Fine. First minute turns, good. There. Getting from 1 to 50 now in shuttle and takes around 12 ish hours or so. Oh, wait, wait, sorry. Getting from 1 to 50. So. You're, you don't make, you don't play Shadowlands content if you're from 1 to 50. And it just takes you 12 hours to get from 1 to 50 to roll a new character. Wow, that's fast. But still, that's cool. Hey, right, bon appetit, man. You've ordered the food of the gods. Nah, not really. Yeah. Deer? Honey? Baby girl? <laughs> no. That, that don't worry, baby girl never works. Um, you do Shadowlands from fifty plus. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was expecting. She's there, but she has her headphones, so she can't hear my soul. She can't hear my pleas for attention. So it's fine. Okay, so, now that more people have a gather, I'm going to ask again. Tomorrow, Crusader Kings 3? Or, Total War Warhammer? Send a Steam message? Never! She doesn't have Steam. Archers? Yep. Really? Swadian's leveled up? Interesting. Okay. Warhammer 2, Crusader Kings 3, anything else? Hmm, oh yeah, that's good. Another one for Warhammer. So Warhammer's in the lead with one vote. Basic. Also, where are all of those guys? Hey! Emir Mudhalir! Exactly the boy I've been looking for. No, please don't go inside the castle, you cheetah. RuneScape. Hell yeah, RuneScape. No, I never played RuneScape. Ever. Ever. And another one for Crusader Kings 3, so it's a tie. Oh, right, I need to visit the lady. I forgot about the visiting of the lady. I must go to Tulga. We'll go with Crusader Kings 3, okay. Crusader Kings 3 is in the lead. And Crusader Kings 3 is in the lead with just a sliver of vote. Will uh, Total War Warhammer get the lead? Will it defeat its arch nemesis in this thrilling, incredible, high stakes chase to the finish line of Friday slash tomorrow stream? 
I don't think anybody gives a fuck. But all's good. North Warrior, matted arms. Yeah, North Warrior with the beautiful slippers of death. That dude has the slippers of death. That dude is above us here. He is definitely above us. Okay, so to we go. Okay. Okay, at Tulga we have arrived. Go to the lady. Hi, lady. Suppish. Uh, poetry. Good shit. Yeah. She likes me. She really likes me. It's the bandit. Korcha, you are the brother of my lady. Stop. Where the hell did he go? Oh, I can see your steps. I can see your footprints, man. Do you think you can get away from me? I have at least five into tracking. You're not getting away, bruv. That's, that's why. Follow those tracks. Yeah, what did you think of that, bro? Oh, declaration of war between the Kurgis and the Swadians. <gasps> We're at, well, whoa, whoa. Whoop. 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 So, the Kurgis just went to war with Swadia and the Serenids at the same time. <sighs> so, the Serenids declared war to regain lost territory. But what lost territory? You get your intelligence character some strength, right? Until not 12? Nah, I actually just leave them at 9. Cola or Pepsi? Both. I don't care. If I were to choose, if I would have both of them in front of me, I would drink Cola. And then I would drink the Pepsi. But if I'm at a... in a bar or in a location or stuff like that, I wouldn't give a shit. Either works. Rip Swadia Knights will see if they get to leave. Hey, Jinjo, what's up? You heard? Peace with Rodox. Are you kidding me, man? Give me something else. Give me another quest, dude. As you may realize, many of us in. Peerage of the Courage account kind of consider a symbol and Noyan to be quarrelsome and divisive and a liability to your cause. We worry that we will pick fights with other lords, leaving us divided and weak. You pick fights with other lords. People know my views on Sibyl and Noyan already, but if you were to denounce him to his face, you would further erode his standing and discourage your liege from entrusting him with any more power or responsibility. Of course, you would make an enemy of him, but it's being challenged to a duel. Not that you're on good terms with Sibyl and Noyan, but this only means that your blow will hit him even harder. Yeah, fuck off. Intellect characters with 12 strength can get a heavy crossbow, and so they also become very good in combat. Very good in combat-ish. But I usually just want my Lizalith to be a surgeon as soon as possible. He has 9. And he has a heavy crossbow. It's a good weapon. I mean, you only need 12 points to get a siege crossbow. I thought you needed more. But still, it's a good setup. It's fine. Okay, let's go to south. Are you following me, man? You ready to do this? Hello. Emir Amdar. Did I heal my horse? I healed Mahosi. Also, that is a rotten pig. Yeah, I know, man. Get him. Oh, do I reach him before he reaches Bardak Castle? Let's see, let's let's just walk to the left, pretend that we're not following him. He is not very good at that. Maybe you're confusing with Taurus? I don't know. Hey Greg. What did I call you? What? I didn't say anything to you. Let's 
Is your name Emir? What's his face? I was talking about the item in my inventory that I've discarded because it was literally a rotten pig. Not you, Greg. Hey, he fucked up. Let me love you, Emir Am Amdar. Also, I forgot all about my soldiers, of course. Man at arms, good. Hello, Nick John. What, bruh? I simply explained to him the situation. What, bruh, do you mean? But no, seriously, that dude was an idiot for leaving the castle. Okay, it's gonna it's gonna be a little bit on the dark side. Mm, yeah, okay, that screwed me. I thought those were my enemies. Would've been hilarious though. Archers up here, infantry down there, cavalry on the side, infantry stand closer. That's a general bra moment. Sure, just a general bra moment. I, I guess. Get up that da goddamn deer heel. Got the damn damn dear hero. Also, my god, do you boys look buff and big and strong and beautiful. I like buff and big and strong and beautiful men. Okay. Chevaliers, follow me. Pursue me. We're gonna go hit them in the boot. Go, hit them in the boot. The butt attack. Also, what the hell? Smacky. Smacky. Okay, I missed. Infantry charge. Kill them down. Got him. Oh, they're getting hacked and slashed. Oh, they're getting hacked and slashed a lot. Wait. Ah, oh, man. Suck. Good job, my man. Okay, there's a lot of death going in their favor for some odd reason. Is this reinforcements? Also, it seems on maximum difficulty and campaign AI, they have a lot more leveled up soldiers than I thought. Yeah, a lot more boys are fighting the center room. Are they cleaning up house here? Okay, it seems we finally received the reinforcement wave as well. Get this guy out of my way. There. And that's what's up. You might be schizophrenic. Who's schizophrenic, Jinjo? Guys, this suggestion for medieval movies for later on. Robin Hood of Men in Tights. A great medieval movie. Oscar worthy. Good job, man. What's the slaver chief out of Oscar, huh? Nice smack. I'll get the big boy. Ah, oh, you failed me. There it is. Damn. Heavily armored dude is heavily armored. Good. How many did we lose? Eleven. Eleven casualties. Two, two slaver chiefs, two huskarls. Two minute arms, a sharpshooter, a knight. Three marksmen. Eh, the pain. The pain. Eh, I don't know. Stop, I yield to you. Is that a cunning lord? Oh, I don't remember. I think that's a cunning lord, if I remember correctly. He called you schizophrenic, Greg. You should be totally mad. And you should totally yell at him. Marshall? Mm, not 100% sure. You, you know what? You fought well. 
You're a good man. I'll try to find a way to repay you. No, no, no. Yeah, he's Marshall. You're correct. He's Marshall. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Stubborn Courser. Sure, that's going to be useful. And trash that we need to sell. There. The cunning one has a different remark, different retort. That'll be fine. Two more Huskarls, another sharpshooter, archer as Nord Warrior, trained footman. Swan in many turns. And Shavi has to level up, right? Yeah, that's it. Hey Kiwi, welcome back to the end, dude. My favorite beer? Um I don't really have a favorite beer. I would say it's dark beer with a little bit of extra fizz in it. That would be it. That would be my current favorite beer. Sadly, my previous favorite beer um, is no longer being made. I liked the oak. That's what it was called. The oak was the good shit. But it's not like they don't make it anymore in Romania, so womp womp. What did you call him? He's a joke from a movie, and I think he was an honorable lord. He's a good guy. Can't be a stream without Rove talking about beer. Do I talk about beer that much? I mean, I feel like you guys are more talking about beer. I'm not just saying. Okay, let's go to Tolgi. Are we taking out Halmar or something? That'd be great. That'd be glorious. You made the question. Okay, would you recommend you my headsets? Yours just broke an hour ago and it's frustrating. Sure, yeah, recommend my headsets. I really like the quality sound for it. It's pretty cool. Go for it. Budweiser for the one? Okay, Said. I'm probably sure that you just said that to piss people off, but in case you didn't, please enjoy Budweiser. Hope you will have a ball with that beer. Hey, Craig Hack. Welcome back to the end, dude. What's up? How off of thou good, sir? Sound and comfort, I highly recommend Logitech G633. Yeah, go with what Kiwi said. Maybe he is better at that than I am. Okay, check the tavern. Kiss the ransom broker. And there. And get rid of those guys. Big pile of cash. Mark Cavalry. Hmm, maybe later. Sweet or sour? Sour. In my case. How are we looking? 103. What did... I kind of lost a little bit of everything, but I would like to add some extra RTRs. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do a quick trip in this area, grab some road up recruits. Should be fine. Soldiers leveled up. More marksmen. Good. Gonna do a quick stop at Narva, and we'll see where we go from there. Probably to the southwest, to the front lines. Let's go towards Halmar and see what the garrison looks like. Also, what the what's the marshal doing? Hey, hey, they're burning shit down. That is stupid. You're burning shit down. That is stupid. Why not take Halmar with me? Halmar would be where it's at. Are they gonna come in and save that village? I would say that's a no. Also, 73 soldiers. Damn, I could take this castle myself. Granted, with a big pile of losses, but I could take it. No, let's go. Keep going. 
We're going to use this time to get ourselves some Rodax. Yes. Just don't declare war on the Rodax right now. No, not the sequestration. Anything but the sequestration. Yeah. Is your slow companions hate and like each other mechanic in Battle Lord? No, hasn't been re implemented yet. There is no hate or like mechanic yet functioning in Battle Lord. The demon will have sex with an angel. They won't care. Oh, this place is barren. Oh, hello. Well, they're taking Jalakala. Now that explains where's where all the Swadian boys are at. Two tribesmen. Okay, what? We can have three more, but another attack. Twelve. For I fear for my life. Your favorite beer is. Sure, go for it, Jin Chow. State your opinion. Mark your territory. What is it? So are we just gonna build, burn some villages here and there? Because that's got it. Wait, whoa, 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 you're going the wrong way. Oh my god, they took Velika. You're going the wrong way, brother, but they took Velika. That is a big shot. You don't drink shit? Okay, sure. Good for you, man. If you don't drink, that's all good. Archer, Nord. All of those crossbowmen. Yeah. Hmm. Wow. Swaddings are impressive on max difficulty. They don't fuck around. Burning villages is, all of, is what Warband's all about. But that's mean. That's super mean. Has anyone tried Elder Scrolls Online? You've only played Skyrim and loved it, and there were very mixed opinions about uh, Elder Scrolls Online. Um. Okay, Caleb. Elder Scrolls Online is Skyrim. It has some interesting stories and quests mixed into it, and it has an interesting world that you can explore. Um with the option of uh, getting friends to play with you, or making friends to play with you. But they don't usually play with you until end game. Besides that, um, what else can I say? The combat feels very MMO-ish, and you'll usually want to play from a third-person perspective instead of a first-person perspective, and that's kind of it. Have fun. Um, why did you say shit again, Jinjo? What is it? Count Nasuge. Hey, Count Nasugi. Ah, he's gonna seek shelter in Ergalon, and I won't be able to catch him. Yeah. But if I walk this way, will he come out and play? Nah. He did not. Okay, boys, the entirety of the Swadian Mil Armada is taking Jalkala and practically destroying the Rodax. What do we do? Hey, Dennis, welcome back to the dude. Meant to say that the combat is shit? No, I meant to say that the combat is MMO-ish. It is literally an MMO-like combat. That's it. But seriously, you can play Elder Scrolls Online just for the stories. Have fun. You're eating diet lasagna, dry as fuck. I'm sorry if you're then, my man. Grab yourself a drink. Commander Arms, trained Crossy the Bow. Keep going. You wouldn't recommend it, but whatever. Did you check the story? Chin Chow? Or am I gonna start my kingdom too soon to ask, my mate? Hey Drix. Welcome back to the end, man. Thanks for the evening all. Have a good one. Brula Land sends wishes of dishes with bitches and dickish snitches. Rush to the aid of the boys. For the story alone is just meant. You can enjoy a game just for the story alone, my man. How much lo longer am I stringing for? It's a secret. I don't want to tell. 
I don't want a tattletale. Archers here. Infantry here. Cavalry charge. What playthrough is this today? You don't read the description? Just a good old fashioned uh Warband playthrough. Nothing really special about this one. Just me enjoying a good old classic and playing it by what I consider to be the book. Now that's my boy. That dude right there is an enemy. Got him. Friend friend got him got him that's another enemy right there another dude on the horse oof nice I killed the swatty and night that's what's up Did some damage how can you tell your own friends from without a circle on their heads you look for the shields that dude's clearly not mine. You learned the shields, dude. You learned the shields. And you just start remembering the style of their armor. Hey, Revolve, you started your POP campaign and all the bandits fuck you up. Why are they so damn OP? Because the game is so damn OP. Oh god, there's a reinforcement line right there. Where my boys at? Am I look even going in the right direction? No, I'm not going in the right direction. Reinforcements have arrived. Okay, that's good. One sec. Uh, so no, literally seeing the shield is what gets me. Um, so regarding the bandits in uh, P.O.P. and Prophecy of Pandora, stay away from anything that is not a looter or a Red Brotherhood dude or a... Um, what else? Yeah, you will usually be able to fight looters, forest bandits, and Red Brotherhood in P.O.P. at the beginning of the game. Anything else will most likely kick your ass until you have a spe more specialized army. Oh god. There. Beautiful. How do you get your custom knighthood order? It's gonna be a while, man. Also, I'd recommend that you watch my guide for more information on each, each subject. On exactly what do you need? Damn, that's a lot of boys. Oh, I getting you? Nice. What? 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 That is the end of. No, that's one of mine. One of mine. You did like three hours of it, didn't get to the Custom Nitro Order yet, just jump directly to the Custom Nitro Order. But it's gonna be a while until you get there, man. Holy crap, Baskets, no, not again. Yes, Alan. Yes, Alan, you son of a bitch, you saved me. You saved me, you crazy son of a gun. Love you. Kill the Swadia Nighties. I bet he has butter in his pants. Also, do you guys have a by chance a horse for me? Come on, you dinguses. Give me a horses. Give me a horsey. So my person is getting killed by Swadia Knights. Yeah, that's not good. Some really fast bandits and you can't run. They just... Oh, yeah. Invest in pathfinding. Definitely invest yourself in some pathfinding, mate. That's going to save your life. That's going to save you a lot of time. Hey, the Swatty Knight got killed by a Kerchet Lancer. What is this? Got him. I'm here, bitch. Nice! Good job! Got killed by a Kerchet Lancer from behind. From the A. We lost two men. Two slaver chiefs. My allies lost 30 men. But they lost 77. <laughs> okay, 38. That's fine. Run like a mother effer is to survive? Yeah, I guess so. I guess so. But yeah, that is what you need to do in POP. You gotta run. And that's a lot of calves. Uh, yeah, calves, stay behind there. You go stay behind there for a little bit. 
we have to see what we're looking at. Hello, Notorious Maddie. Welcome to the end. Been watching my YouTube content for a while, and you absolutely love it, man. Thanks, dude. I'm glad you like it. Have you got the graphics modded on this? Nope. No graphics. Nothing. Pure vanilla. I trained my troops on looters? No. Not really. At the beginning, I do. At the beginning, I should train them up a little bit on the looter side. Looter side of life, man. Looter side of life. Holy shit, that is a big ass mace. Get them, my boys. Break them up. Yeah, in POP, you do train them at the beginning a little bit on looters, and then you train them on forest bandits, and then you fight the Vanscary in the West. Ah, the good old fashioned Vanscary in the West. Those were the days, dude. Those were the days when you fought the real looters. Not the real looters, the real Sea Raiders. The ones that dicked you. Oh god! That was a big spear. Uh, are you talking about... Uh, well, what's the name of it? Oh god, what is going on? Where are my... Oh my god, where are my allies? Run! 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 <sighs> that got... Three of my sharpshooters... And one of my veterans and a slaver chief... To die. Those shits left my boys to die. That is my job. It's my job to leave my allies to die. Fuck's sake. Notorious Maddie, thank you for subscribing. Welcome to Hit Point Ten. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I played the Eagle. I played a little bit of the Eagle. I found the world a little bit on the empty side. Okay. Fuck you guys, I will let you do whatever the hell you want. Use your own soldiers to defeat the enemy, I don't care. It's good, but yeah, pretty empty and all the battlefields were the same last time I tried the mod. Mm -hmm. Okay. So yeah, the way I recognize my boys is the shield. Okay, so what are you boys gonna do? You're just gonna stay away and play and run around the rosies? Fighting Vanscris is you asking for please hit me in the face with an axe. Yeah, exactly. It's so fun. So fun. Oh crap, I released that too early. Oh! Cheeky. Also, that lance looks awesome. Get smacked in the buttocks. Incontinenta buttocks will be your name. Ha! Ah, defeated. Is he running after? Oh, good lord. That's a lot of spears. Brittany Spears, motherfucker. I don't know why I said that. Didn't the POP have the horse archer fix? They did. It is pretty hardcore. To fight them. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Those are some spiky spears. There. Well, as long as you don't quarter camp them, they don't. They are, they're okay. They don't get super confused. But if you quarter camp them, it is the end of them. For they go bonkers. I think it just needs more work. But I feel the content it has was well done. Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely, it's a cool. It's a cool mod. I still recommend it to people. It's literally. Napoleonic Wars single player. <laughs> Getting booped upon. I did not know that the SWAT, not the SWAT, yeah, the SWATian sergeants were so cool looking. They're clad black in armor and shit, it's awesome. But if you corner camp, you deserve it anyway. I mean, if you corner camp, it's your choice. It's your tactic. If you want to abuse and cheese the system, that is your choice. But remember this, Eric Nader will forever hate you. But it's fine, even if you don't do it, Eric Nader will forever hate you. So it's fine. All's good, boys. So seriously, do whatever the fuck you want and enjoy the video game. You played it online, it was fun? Cool. I haven't played it in a long time, but you've never been a fan of this game's multiplayer mode? Indeed. 
not a big fan of the multiplayer mode either. Well, as long as you don't care about Ergnator, that's perfectly fine. Yep, he doesn't discriminate with his hate. He hates everybody equally. There's a jerk somewhere over there. Catch my big pointy... Okay, that was not my dick though, but it's fine. I'm gonna go get him. Go get him. Hey, he ran away like a little bitch. That's amazing. We won, brothers. We won. Yeah, I've turned up just in time. Count race escaped. God damn it. Okay, give me those sharpshooters. Mad at arms. Swadian knights. Those sergeants. Slave crusher mountain. Infantry. Yeah, I give everything for now. Yeah, let's see some of that good stuff. You don't need to use horse archer AI fix anyway, so. Okay, Jinjao, your choice, man. Your choice. Do whatever you want, man. There. Got some of that good stuff. Ellen leveled up, that's amazing. You found Horse AI Fix mod, but you didn't see the difference. Magic. It's a placebo, dude. It's a placebo. Yeah. Okay. Charisma. Pathfinding Trainer. Power Strike's already there. Weapon Master's already there. Could increase that right of the nap. Nah, it's fine. That's okay. I'll just wait for more points. More points for Gryffindor. Marksman. Trained cross. De Chave. No. So at least need to wait for her to level up. So back to the drawing board. Or at least tell how many I lost. I lost a few. Yet again. Okay. Let's go to Nara, which is under siege. No. No, not my Nara. Where are my boys? What are they doing? Hmm? Did I choose what to play for Friday? Not yet. People are kind of split between Warhammer 2 and Crusader Kings 3. Like usual. Because, goddammit, my chat can't be decisive. They really can't. They can't do it. Yeah, he will be lord of my future faction someday. He will be my baby. Trained Rodox. Goddamn that moment you spill an entire pint of lager on yourself when watching a stream. Back soon. Ooh, I'm sorry to hear that, Trix. Sorry to hear that, my dude. So Jinjo wants Crusader Kings 3. You know what? If the people are gonna be such to such a 50 and 50 to 50 degree you know if they're not they're gonna be so indecisive i'm just gonna go ahead and play whatever the hell i'm in the mood tomorrow so it is gonna be a surprise mm -hmm. i think that's good i'll keep that yep 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 Yep, yep. And all of that food, please. All of that food, please. Yes, yum. Good. Democracy doesn't work. Indeed. Democracy doesn't work, so I'll just vote. Where's the poll? I remember the votes, Aragnator. I remember the votes. What is your vote, Aragnator? What do you desire for tomorrow's stream? I will not talk like that anymore. Why? Okay. My wife finds it annoying when I talk like that, so I will stop talking like that. Huh? Oh, shoot. Strange. Okay. Well, so, she doesn't like it, so I'm just not gonna do that anymore. Report to Brulan Oyan has been cancelled because he's probably dead. Wandering Sheik, Hired Blade, that's fine. 
Righto, let's see who wants that. Lazulet, you want some new equipment? No. You're already looking good. But this is better. There. You wanna see something thrown at me? Well, you're a schmuck. Okay. Like the Artemider, sure. 37, there. Thicky the play, yeah, that's gonna work. We'll all solve those two. Market goods, choop choop. And get myself groups and some bread, there. Crusader Kings 3 or War Total War Warhammer. Aragnator. That's it. Those are your options. Choose your destiny. Have fun. No, bot. I'm not in a mood today. I'll click on your delicious clickness tomorrow. I promise. I promise. No Star Sector. Not in the mood for Star Sector. I'm not in the mood to go through all of the mods and make sure that they're all up to date. Because I have to manually check that shit because the version checker doesn't, doesn't work anymore with Star Sector. So now, total war. Okay. So it's still a tie. Still a tie between the two. Okay. Recent dev comment is not much, but something. Later, we will add more micromanagement for clan parties. Okay. But Jin Zhao, you said that you wanted to see Crusader Kings 3. Are you changing your vote? Oh wow, they've been saying Triple Color, that's amazing. Interesting. They didn't, didn't get it yet. Hello? Who was that? Was that a dude planning on burning villages? Because I will kick ass. Wait, isn't that a orgasm face, Jinjo? I can see the amount, but I don't understand it. Because to me, it looks like a guy that's like, oh, or something. Maybe I'm mistaken. There, check the tavern. Nah. No, no, leave. Okay, Holomar is under siege. I like that. I want more. Oh, that's boring. I see. Okay. Didn't, did not know. Never knew. That's gay, yeah, that's bored to sleep. Okay. You think Total War is more enjoyable? <gasps> no! Oh my god, Sanyar Khan is getting smushed. Smushed did. Oh my god, things went so south. They went so south. You. Oh god, he's actually attacking me. Can I take this guy on? I don't think I can take him on. Oh shit, he's coming. He's coming, boys. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Which faction do you want to see in Total War? You take a Swadian Chief, I take a Swadian Knight, boy. Yeah, level 23, baby. Can't really tell which ones are mine and which ones are theirs. Shit. Okay, I'm surrounded. Shit. Got him. This one I killed by Swatty Knight. Yeah, I'll make that work. Got him. 
useful. Come on, you sons of bitches. Oh, crap. That is a spearman. I think I'll need to retreat. You boys shoot, baby. Shoot them. Shoot them. You boys are not doing so bad right now, aren't you? Oh, God. What the hell? That was a thick hit. Holy shit balls, I'm dead. No, move. I'm escape. <sighs> yeah, they're smushing my forces and I'm gone. I will take a lot of you fuckers with me though. Oh, or not. There. I should play whatever the fuck I want. Between these two, I'd like to play something. 14 died. They lost 36. Really? They only lost less than us. That's bad. Let's leave and run. Hopefully it won't happen again. Mind you soldiers, huh? Okay. Those boys. Those boys hurt me. I hurt myself today. Mm, we good. Either Belagar or Strasnik, pick your poison. So you want me to play the most difficult campaigns in the game. Right, Jin Chao? You recommend to choose uh, Warhammer Norskan tribe? Because you want to see me flail around until I reach Doomstacks? I played them on very high, not on legendary. Oh, so very, practically very high for combat, which is legendary, and then legendary for the campaign difficulty. Is that correct, Jin Zhao? That's what you want to see? Of course, of course. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Or you can just, you know. There are tougher ones? Which ones, Aragnator? To be honest, I never managed to make the vampire pirates work, for example. Never could play them properly. Never really understood their concept or their ratios or what, what units are good or what units are bad. So that could be an interesting campaign to figure out. So, Ignator, what would you recommend? And don't really, don't just recommend me tough stuff or difficult stuff, just rec also recommend me fun stuff. You played once with vampires and you were confused as fuck. Go Skaven. Skaven, once you have a Daka Daka army, you're good to go with Skaven. Vampire Pirates is just Necrofix Colossus spam? Yeah, but until you get there, what do you actually use, Robson? It's not really that easy to reach Necrofax Colossus spam, right? Until until you get there, what do you use? What do you do? You think the Vampire Pirates are on the Aegisir side? Okay, if you were to not use Necrofax Colossus, what do you use in, the, in their army? Jinjo. Probably I need, need, need strong units, okay. Catep. Oh, Teclis is horrible. Kalida got one of the hardest starts. Uh, the one from... The northeastern coastal desert location. New Clan Mulder also looks to have a tough start. Don't know where, where the New Clan Mulder start is. Don't know where they're based. But difficult equals fun? Not always. Difficult can also mean tedious. And a bore. Even if enemies have a few strong starting units, not cutting monsters, then you just throw exploding corpses at them. Um... But exploding corpses are useless. What? Arc of the Black because of the start too? Well, yeah, he needs to fight dwarves, which he's really not equipped to deal with. And he needs to fight... Um, these guys, what are their name? 
Bretonia, which again, he doesn't really have the right tools to deal with. Okay. Alan, did I level you up or am I saving a point with you? Oh man, I'm saving a point with you, okay. Sharpshooters, trained crossbowmen. Enemy's kind of a defeating me. Enemy is kind of kicking my ass simply with the sheer number of high tier troops they have. Interesting. Oh, really? Their start is the Hell Pit? Cool. Hardcore. Hardcore. If you go against other hmm, vampire pirates, lizardmen, you can use them pretty easily against heavy infantry. Hmm. Skaven, second capital near Kislev. Yeah, I know. I know where Hell Pit is. It's fine. Uh, the huge Chinese mod, 108 heroes. If you're talking about that one. Ransom Broker, nice. Give it to them. Also, it seems my jack of all trades is not really paying off that much. Hmm, should I either go pure. Either pure calf spam or pure inf spam. We'll see. But decide next time. Because that's going to be it for today, guys. Yeah, that's going to be it. And if you guys... Um, the reason why I'm ending a little bit the stream a little bit earlier is because my voice is going bye-bye. I can feel it going bye-bye. I've talked very much today. Not just the stream, including work. So that's going to be it for today. Uh, if you guys like what I do, hit that follow button. It helps me out, makes it show room, makes everything more awesome. If you want to further support me, also subscribe. Uh, if you're on YouTube, um, like, subscribe, leave a comment. Helps with the algorithm. And that's it. Wish you boys and girls a wonderful day. Bye-bye.